first alert weather with Cassie Campbell is sponsored by St. Francis Healthcare System. Today has been pretty nice compared to the past few days. We've had those winds have calmed down, the clouds still being a little bit stubborn, mainly in our most eastern counties. They're slowly going to continue to trend to the east. We're going to get some warmer air to really start filtering in for your weekend, and we're going to get a little bit of sunshine to at least kick off our Saturday. As we head into tonight, those clouds are going to move out. We're going to be under clear, calm skies tonight through Saturday morning with the clear skies and the calm winds and temperatures in those 30s. There's a chance to have some patchy frost late tonight into early Saturday morning. We are going to see mostly clear skies throughout the afternoon. Lots of sunshine tomorrow. The winds are going to be calm. This is looking like the best day of the weekend as we head through Saturday evening. Still staying under those pretty clear skies. Clouds filter in for Sunday morning. Winds are really going to start to pick up out of the south ahead of our next front and could get caught under a few showers Saturday morning, Saturday afternoon. So we head into Saturday afternoon and into the evening. A few stronger storms are likely across the heartland, mainly for Sunday evening. Going to keep a close eye on these as we head through Sunday night, but most of those work out of the area for Monday, which is the Heartland Eclipse. That being said, Sunday, most of the Heartland is under the level one out of five. That's the chance for some strong to severe storms on Sunday. Main threat as of now being some hail and maybe some gusty winds associated with those thunderstorms that work through Sunday afternoon, Sunday evening. Dry tomorrow, rain chances likely on Sunday, drying out for Monday, and it's going to become a pretty active pattern as we head towards the middle of next week. Lows tomorrow morning heading out the door. Grab the coats in the morning. It is going to be quite cold. Look at that. 30 in Mount Vernon, 34 in Paducah, 35 in Union City, 33 in Cape. Maybe you want to go ahead and start the cars in the morning if you're heading out early, but by the time we get to the afternoon, it's going to heat up quite nicely. A little bit around that average mark in the 60s with some partly cloudy skies throughout the afternoon. We're going to continue to see those temperatures just steadily increase the next couple of days. 64 tomorrow will be in the 40s Saturday night into Sunday. 70s by Sunday with those scattered showers and thunderstorms again, mainly late afternoon and into the evening. The winds are going to pick up out of the south Sunday and into Monday. It will be breezy on Monday. As of now, looking a little bit on the partly cloudy sky, it's still going to see some clear skies for the time being. Upper 70s, it's at least going to be warm and dry before we track quite a bit of a wet pattern. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, scattered showers are likely. We'll be in the 70s through Wednesday, though, and then we'll slowly see those 60s by next Thursday.